Hi, I'm Roxana from VP Estate and in this video I will show how to manage the guest option in VP Rentals team. The team has three options regarding guest functionality. You will have the option to use guest separation, adults, children and infants. The second option is to have guest number as plain numbers without a separation. And the third option is to not use guests at all. Each option for guest will be described in different videos. In this video you will learn how to manage the guests with the option to have a play number drop down. That means we'll need to set this in team options, general, booking settings. First, the option to enable advanced guest control will need to be set to no and after that means we'll need to set the maximum number of guests in the guest dropdown. I will save changes. And also for submission form, the admin will need to go to payment and submit, listing submit page, and from the fields for listing submission, he will need to deselect these two fields. Do not consider children as guests and maximum extra guests above capacity. The fields need to be deselected as when the advanced guest control is set to no, the maximum extra guest option will not work. Next, from owner point, I will show the settings by editing an existing listing. The owner will have the guest number field and will need to select from the dropdown the number of guests allowed for his listing. I will set to 10 and save changes. In price section you will need to set a price per night but if you wish to use price per guest you need to add a value for extra guest and tick the option to pay by the number of guests. If you use this option we recommend to add the same price for price per night and extra price per guest, so the search by price to return the correct results. Now I will simulate a booking from guest end to show how this guest option works. I will select check in, check out. For this property I have enabled instant booking and I do not have a fee set for deposit or service fee. So the booking will be confirmed without the owner approval and without the guest paying any fee. I will select the number of guests. If I will select a bigger number than the one set by owner, once I press the instant booking button, I will have this warning. The number of guests is greater than the property capacity. So I will select nine guests and place the booking. And place the booking. Since I have instant booking, I will see here the booking details. And once I press confirm booking, the booking placed will be confirmed. The guest will see the confirmed status for the booking made and here we'll see all booking details. The owner also will see the confirmed booking and here we'll be able to see all the booking details. This wraps our video. Thank you for watching and do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to get instant notification on new videos.